Hello friends, um, welcome. So uh, like there are multiple supports we can add. For example, there are uh, supports like title, editor, comments, revisions, trackbacks, author, excerpt, page attributes, thumbnail, custom fields, post formats. All these, all these are the uh, supports we can provide. For, uh, for now, I have provided supports for title, editor, excerpt, thumbnail, author, and revision okay so title and editor is must needed to have to have a custom post type or at least title we we should have okay so here you can see go to the here add new so you can see the add a title here then this is our block editor area where we can add a uh, editor okay if we do not add it here for example here i'm just removing or just passing the add except if i just refresh the page and it will change the entire area because we are not using the editor the block editor that's why it's provide this uh, non gutenberg uh, ui or you can say a classic uh, ui okay so and these are accepts and authors all all this um, all this we have used okay so i'm just changing back to again editor and similarly accept thumbnail so um, you now if we refresh the page we can see the, uh, our uh, good block editor ui and for excerpt, we have added this excerpt field. So if you declare the excerpt support, then it will add this uh, meta field excerpt where we can write uh, excerpt uh, of, for our movie. Okay. And then thumbnail, thumbnail is used to fill feature image. We have just changed these labels to movie poster. And the author, author used to just set who has created uh, uh, this uh, movie post. So from here, we can see, we can select the different author. And the revision, revision is used to like when we change or add anything, then it will create a different revision. So for example, if I go here, maybe go to this uh, here and you can, um, uh, okay, just a minute. I think there is no revisions has been created yet. Okay, but if you, the, there is a revisions, you can see if you change the, uh, if you change the content, Okay, so it will provide a revision or maybe I have just added a wrong name. For example, go to the movies. We have revision. So yeah, I have made a mistake. So it will be a revisions. Okay, so now if I just reload this now, uh, I have to add it, update something. So I'm just uh, bold this variable, bold it and then go to an update. Okay, and if I just refresh it, now you can see here the revisions for my link. I think I still made a mistake something. Okay, but uh, there has to be displayed the uh, revision here. So revision is used to uh, revision is used to have a different like whenever you make updates, it will store the previous update. So just in case if you want to go back. Uh, to the previous revision you just want to compare what uh, latest content have been changed uh, for the particular post then you can you can see it okay then uh, go to the here then we have talked about the supports and also you can uh, you can add remove the supports with the add add post type support and add uh, remove post type support so you can also do that so for example uh, if you want to add uh, some support uh, for already a uh, default post types like pages attachments or or the post or maybe if there is you are using a one, some plugins and that plugin uh, register the custom post types and if you want to add some support then you can add this you can use this uh, uh, function to to give the support okay then uh, there is a register meta box function so if you want to override a default uh, meta boxes function of the wordpress then you can use this one but we don't need to override right now then taxonomies what are the taxonomies you want to assign uh, to the custom post type so when you register custom post types and you want to assign a taxonomy for example currently i haven't said uh, i want to assign these categories and tags custom taxonomies uh, to my movie post type as well so what i can do is i will just copy this one here in the taxonomy uh, let me just added in the last 
okay taxonomies and i will just pass it's a array so it's an array of string so i will just pass a category and these are the uh, taxonomies log of the default category and tags and here it's a post underscore tag okay so it will also register a custom uh, uh sorry default taxonomy categories and text to the movies okay so similarly if you want to do with some different taxonomies that that you can also pass it here okay and uh, from here then has archive so has archive is used to whether our post type uh, have a archive page or not okay so by default it's a false and you we have to you enable through we have to pass through to have a post archive and that archive page uh, has archive have the like the different pages okay i will i will uh, uh, come back to that and there is a rewrite uh, rewrite uh, rule and this is the rewrite i'm skipping it right now we will talk about this rewrite into the rewrite api uh, another video like rewrite api videos okay um then all the query well and all that related to the rewrite rules uh, then whether it's whether this post can be exported or not okay so this where this has been used so for example in the tools go to the export and here you can see the movies okay so if i just uh, and by default it's a true so if i just pass this value here can export and if i pass false then probably it will remove this movies from here if i just change then movies has been removed okay so whether you want to allow the export of the content or not uh, this argument can be used by default it should be a true we should allow the users to export the content okay then delete with user whether you want to delete the post if the uh, uh, author of that post have been deleted okay so for that that this argument can be used uh, then templates uh, these are the template and template log uh, regarding uh, whether you want to create or provide a templates um, in the block editor so for example if i want to keep it uh, some of the like blocks by default when i add a new movie okay and some content structure should be there uh, so that users uh, directly started uh, like adding a content instead of adding or setting the layout then we can uh, uh, this a template can template uh, argument can be used and template log whether you want to log that template so if you if it's a true then no other blocks can be added if it's false then users can modify it as well okay and there is a built-in whether this is internal use only or uh, like just to make sure then by default it will be a false it's not a built-in so built-in is just mentioned to whether these are the post types used or or if it's only internally used okay and then edit link whether this is for internal use only whether you want to provide edit link or not okay see you on our next video jay wordpress